welcome back to our channel today we'll be making another millet's cake recipe so let's jump into it so today in this video we'll be making chocolate millet's cake using itirani's cake premix they have given the instructions behind the package and we'll be following that today we'll be making it without egg so in this packet they have given us a measuring cup which measures till 30 ml they have given us a premix powder and they have given us jaggery powder so there is no maida there is no white sugar so let's start so starting i preheated my oven to around 25 minutes in 180 degrees you have to add the jaggery powder in the bowl and now we will add 110 milliliters of oil And now we'll mix it together. Now we'll add 100 ml of milk. And we will mix it gradually. Now we will add our pre-mix powder in. And we will mix it. Now we will add another 100 ml of milk. So totally we add 200 ml of milk. And we will mix it together. So we have mixed everything in and your final consistency will be like in ribbon, it, will be, it has to be thin because it's a millet cake and it takes more moisture, more water. And finally we have to add 15 ml of lemon juice and mix it. So lemon juice acts as a baking element to your cake instead of adding baking you know, vinegar or curd or Now cake batter is ready. I have already greased my pan. Now transfer the batter into the pan. Just give a tap twice so that the air bubbles burst out. Now we'll bake our cake inside the oven for around 35 minutes, 180 degrees Celsius. Our cake is completely ready right now. It took around 40 minutes to bake. It's coming out clean. So cut it from the edges and let it cool down. You can take it out in a plate also. Cake is cooled down completely. It's soft and fluffy. It's so good I've already tasted it and it's healthy since it is made at home it's made with millets and even kids would love to eat it because it's a chocolate cake obviously so to buy this pre-mix powder the link is given in the description below do try this recipe out thank you these are the instructions which you can follow if you're doing it in a gas stove or with egg and do check this product out the link is in the description below and thank you for watching this video.